Hi, in this video you'll learn how to use the mask brush in sculpting. I'll be using the 2.81 version of Blender. Suppose you want to sculpt only one portion of our mesh so that the surrounding parts are not affected. We can achieve that by using the mask brush. Let's create a simple planet with a mountain range on its surface and then sculpt the surface of the area surrounding the range first and then the surface inside the mountain range. But first let's start by deleting the default cube and creating a UV sphere. Let's scale the sphere 10 times as 10, okay? And add the subdivision surface modifier. So let's go to modifiers and modifiers subdivision surface and let's set subdivisions to 3 in both render and viewport. Fine. Let's apply the modifier. Good. And this is going to be our planet. Now go to sculpt mode and select the mask brush. Turn off mirroring. Now use the brush to mask the area which should not be affected by sculpting. Let's say here. This area should not be affected by sculpting. Now let's use the draw brush to sculpt the area around the mountain's range. So this is going to be our mountain's range. And now let's sculpt the area surrounding this place. Okay. As you can see, the area which we masked is not affected at all. Now let's try to sculpt the masked area. As you can see, it doesn't work. Fine. And now we want to invert the mask so that we can sculpt this part and this part should not be affected. Now in order to invert the mask, you can hit Ctrl I. So Ctrl I and the mask is inverted. So now you can sculpt inside the mountain range over here without affecting the surrounding area. So have a look. Fine. Well, it slightly affects this area here because it's not totally dark. It's not totally black. If we wanted this area not to be affected at all, it should be masked totally black. But this will do for our purposes. So let's make this mountain range. As you can see, this time only this part here is affected. If we try to sculpt this part, which is masked, it doesn't work. Now let's set the radius to 25. And sculpt some more detail. Again, only this area is affected, not the masked one. Finally, we want to clear the mask. To do that, hit Alt plus M. Alternatively, you could do that in the mask menu. Mask, clear mask. So this is generally how this brush can be used. Okay, that's it for this video. If you like it, a thumbs up would be great. Also, make sure to subscribe for future videos. If you want to leave a comment or ask a question, you're welcome to do so. Thanks for watching.